One thing that's really weird with Affinity Photo, there's no image menu with adjustments, general adjustments for changing colour. Now you can use a persona, but say you want to change the colour of one particular layer. Well, how do you change it? Well, if I go over here and I can go to Layer, and I can go down here to New Adjustment Layer, and I'm just going to use one of these. I'm just going to go with HSL. And I can recolor. Now, all of those layers will change. Every single one, anything below this HSL shift adjustment will change into purple. We'll say I want to change only a couple of them. So I'm just going to drag it down. And you can see as I drag it down, I can just select it. And you get this little line, just a little blue line there, and release. Now, you can see now the ones that are above, these ones, are untouched. These ones will change. And you can then drag it if you decide you want to go in all of them, just drag it up again up to there. But say you want it on just one layer. Go here, select this, and then just drag it down. Say this one, the third one there. So just go there and you can see that's highlighted now, that there, and release. And now, if I expand it out, you can see the HSL shift adjustment is just applied to this layer. All the other layers are untouched. So any change to this effect will just change and affect this one. So you want to group a particular set of images. Well, just group it. You can simply select this, just two of them. You could select three or four, five or six, and right click and just go down to group. So they are grouped. Well, what you can do, you can simply go here, select this, and then just drag down into the group. And again, make sure that's highlighted. And now only that group will be affected. And if you change the order, doesn't matter. So you can select this one, just drag it above, reposition it. But again, only those ones in that group will be modified by that color adjustment. And there it is. If you want to remove it again, simply select it and just drag it out and place it at the top. Or if you want to get rid of it completely, just delete it and that's just gone. That's a quick way of working with adjustments in Affinity Photo. If you've got any questions, please let me know in the comments below. Like or dislike, always appreciated. Thank you much.